I'm proud that Country Day is a, is a nationally known private school that cares about everyone. And I think it sets the standard for education, not just among private schools, but among public schools, about how important it is to ready young people for the new world. The campus was named for Mr. Cannon in appreciation and recognition for what he did for this school. This campus could have received a huge gift for the naming opportunity. And rightfully, it went to James Gray Cannon for his efforts in making this school possible. The plain truth is, he kept this school afloat when it would have probably closed its doors from lack of funds. And one day, he, at a board meeting, he made the motion that we build some tennis courts. He got up and left, and I voted against his motion. About two months later, I was crossing the street downtown with him. He said, Jim, I heard you voted against my motion. I said, yes, sir, I thought we should raise the money before we built the tennis courts. He said, well, why don't you make that possible? I need a gift for me. Being around the Stuart Dixons and the Jimmy Cannons had a significant impact on my life. Just observing older people and what they contributed and what fulfillment they got from helping other people. Mr. Cannon was a saint, and there are not many saints in this world. He was quiet, a good listener, but when he spoke, people listened. I gained much more than I gave uh, because really this was the first uh, institution that I chaired. And I was with people, the Stuart Dixons and Jimmy Cannons, and I learned a lot from them. What I valued was I was exposed to people, very talented people who had served on a lot of boards that knew how to be a board member, which when I became chairman of other institutions, really I learned most of it at Country Day. Places are special because the culture of the place and the culture they create for both the faculty and the students. It's special because, in my judgment, this place understands that the faculty is the school. It's not these buildings. It's not the, all this groomed whatever. It's the interface of the faculty with the students.